Hi everyone, welcome to Just Do Electronics. In this project, we build a GSM based smart shopping trolley with the help of this RFID tag. Suppose if you buy to this any product, just you scan this RFID tag and the LCD will be displayed the total price. With the help of this one push button, when you press this push button, the GSM sending this proper text message, I mean the proper bill. In future, you just send this to UPI ID also and your barcode okay let's go and start to make this project just do electronics all about electronics to require these few components first one is the arduino nano microcontroller board 20 into 4 LCD display, EM18 RFID reader module, RFID tag, SIM 800L GSM module, LM2596 step down converter. 10K potentiometer, a small piezo buzzer, push button, is also push button, LED, I mean the green LED, red LED. And this one is the zero PCB. I soldering all this component. Okay, now I will just try to take a cinematic shot. Okay, let's go and see this circuit diagram. In the circuit diagram, I use this Arduino Nano microcontroller board. This one is the Arduino Nano. Okay, and the microcontroller will be connected to the all this module. Like uh, here, I use this 20 into 4 LCD display. This one is the 20 into 4 LCD display, and they connected with the I2C protocol. I2C means it's required only four wire. SCL, SDA, VCC, and ground. Okay. The SCL pin will be connected to this pin number A5 here. And the SDA pin number connected to this. This one is the SDA pin. And they will be connected to this pin number A4. Okay. And this one is the ground will be common. And the VCC will be connected to this 5 volt. Okay. I use these two LED indication light. First one is the red. And second one is the green. The red will be connected to this pin number A1 and the green will be connected to this pin number A3. Here I just use this indication for this sound and I connected to this small piezo buzzer and they will be connected to this pin number A2. Okay. And I use this EM18 module. EM18 module is only required three wire like VCC, ground, and TX pin. And the TX pin will be connected to this pin number Arduino RX pin. This will be, uh, I mean, this EM18 word call like. You what? TX and RX pin through. Okay. And uh, I use this two push button. This one is this item remove. Suppose if you buy to this any item and you try to remo remove it, I mean, this you not want to this item, just you press and hold this uh, item push button and uh, just you scan your product card, the item will be removed. Okay. And this one is the SMS purpose. Suppose if your total will be completed, then you press this button, the SMS will be going to this particular mobile number. Item remove button will be connected to pin number D6 and the SMS push button will be connected to pin number D5. Okay. And here I use this SIM 800L module and they uh, connected to this UART through. I mean only required TX RX pin 
and the RX pin will be connected to pin number D3 and the TX pin will be connected to pin number D2. The ground will be common and I use this 3.7 volt lithium iron battery and they will be connected to this one on and on off switch and is directly connected to this GSM VCC. I mean this 3.7 volt to the GSM module. Okay. This one is the complete circuit diagram. Suppose if you have any problem, then please comment below. I try to solve your problem. Now let's look this hardware. I assemble the all this component in the zero PCB and in back side I soldering all these wires. I put all this component one by one like Arduino Nano microcontroller board. 20 into 4 LCD display. SIM 800 LGSM module. And EM module, EM18 module. In back side, I soldering all this component with the help of these few wires. This one is the RFID tag. Now the hardware will be completed. Now see this code of this project. Here I use this Arduino ID software. First, you add all this library, defining all this pin. In wired setup, you defining input and output models. In wired loop, you defining I mean the switch card. What the LCD will be display and how much the cost of this product. Okay. What I do, I just uploading this code. I will just select this proper board, select proper board, and hit the uploading button. In the right side, you see uploading will be done. But when I pressing this next time, the uploading is not possible because I not selecting this proper port. Now I selecting proper port and hit this uploading button. Uploading will be done. Okay, let's go and see this proper working of this project. First, I turn on this switch and the LCD will be display. Please add item. I scan this item, the rice added, and total price is 20 rupees. I scan the second item and the T added, and price is 10 rupees. Total price is 30 rupees. I scan my third item. Milk added and price is 30 rupees. Total price is this 60 rupees. I scan the rice added and price is this 80 rupees. But I don't want to this rice. That's why I just press and hold this push button. I and scan this rice item RFID tag. You just see this LCD will be display rice remove and the total price is the 40 rupees. I don't want to this item. Just press and hold this push button and I scan this RFID tag. Total price is the 10 rupees. I add milk and total price is the 40 rupees. I add rice and total price is the 60 rupees. What I do, I just press this yellow button and the LCD will display this SMS send. Within the few seconds, the SMS will be come. When I tap the SMS, the SMS will be open. And the SMS will be display Hi Pratik, your total billing, shopping bill is 60 rupees. In future, you add your UPI ID also. And in future, you add any, I mean, this payment method also. I hope you like this project and if you like this project please hit the like button share it with you all the friends if you new in my youtube channel please subscribe my channel press the bell icon to get notification first thank you for watching have a nice day